Hi guys, it's time to make these videos that I do on a monthly basis. And that is starting with an old system, an old ISO, and then see how you should update if there are any issues. So how to stay rolling, basically. And we start with the one from here, voila. So in, this, in the end of November, right, always end of November, we start building, start testing, and then we update our system. So first off, I'm gonna install the old system, and then we update, and we already know, I believe there were three Archer Lakes keyring updates this month. So yeah, we'll first start with the Archer Lakes keyring and then update our system. That's the main thing to remember. I just was on Linux Mint a few hours ago. And what did I see there? Keys, right? Keys, it's always and everywhere. You can't escape it. So the only thing you can do is get knowledge and know what to do if you get these key errors. So first we install, we do this so we can see something, right? Not the advanced installation because that's going to update everything as well. So that's not what, I, what we want to see now. We want to see how to stay rolling. This is a picture from then and then is a week before November, maybe, maybe a little bit more. And then we update everything and see what messages, errors we all get and explain you how to update the system, how to stay rolling. That is basically the thing, not reinstall always when you, yeah, when you have problems. And of course, please do, eh, if you, you really can't figure it out, I was that like that years ago as well. I said, okay, I give it an, an half an hour, give it another an hour maybe the next day but if you can't find the solution the best thing to do is clean install simple well ask around and then clean install so let's wait for this installation all right let's reboot <coughs> and see what happens Click, 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 all gone. Control T, you update your system. Well, let's, let's make a bigger video. Tutorial. Your Bash RC, that's the default one. Later you can learn about Z, uh, ZSH or about Fish, which have, will have the folder Fish here. So Bash RC contains a few interesting, not a few, a lot of interesting aliases. What I'd like you to do with me now is the following. You can have the alias backup scale. Before we update, the content of scale is this. Then we update, and then, and of course I need to tell you what scale is, but in the meantime, let's do this. What is scale? Scale is a folder, skeleton, etc, scale. Every Linux has one, and if you create a user, then they copy-paste everything that's in here to the user. 10 users, 10 copy-paste, right? Every user gets this setup, a bin, a config, a dot config, so hidden, dot local, and so on. So if things change, they change here. Linux distros don't change your home directory, unless maybe, right, always exceptions. You have to think about tiny window managers because sometimes, right, and what about DWM and CHA, DWM, those are applications. So what about those? But in general, right, we don't touch your .config, your home directory, this guy, we don't touch this. 
In the meantime, like I told you, right? Oops. We have Pierre Schmitz, who is sick. So no, no, no. Pseudo Pacman minus S Arch Linux. And then the keys. Tap, tap. This is all the Arch Linux things. And it's the key ring that we need. So we jump from the November edition. You see the numbering? 2022, November 10 to 12.20. So yesterday. Okay, if that's known, then you can update again. And then we can continue with our story. And action. Okay. So the ETC scale is important and as a result we have also an alias called scal Al yeah i've opened firefox and it's a bit slow so alias scal that's the content <laughs> okay we'll wait for later then and mozilla firefox i was just going to go to the arclinux.com website because all the frequent asked questions are on the landing page. Mm. <laughs> Arcolinux.com, what happened here? It's just a void, it goes in the void. I guess we'll have to wait for updates. Too fast, too quick, too furious. And then we do this. So first you update and backup scale. Then you update. Update is coming from Arch and Arco, not AOR. If you install more stuff from AOR, you need to type NVIDIA is present. You need to do update. Oh, sorry, Apol. Apol also checks the AOR, but looking for AOR upgrades, nothing to do. That's that. Backup scale. So that's a backup from scale, basically. But if you do it before update and after update, then you start learning. Then you compare, what did they change? Well, you just wanna see what changes. So the same is not needed. So there's a folder saying nothing to do. And there's a folder saying nothing to do. This is the stay rolling folder. Sometimes we'll put the script in there. If you want, want to really follow the ISO, right? Without installing from scratch again, setting everything up again, right? Then you run this thing. And in this case, nothing to do. Config fish. We've added aliases for XDW, Wayland. And that's it. So now you know other oh, aliases for W for uh, Wayland. We have made Sway available for variety. So if you are um, at some point in time on Arklinks B Wayland or or I mean Sway or Hyperland, and later on you know all the others, then this will set the background. Okay, we've added, we've made variety more powerful basically. Bash RC, same thing. This is only in the Bash RC. I got sick and tired being on, on Wayfire or River and New WM and, and all that. And it was on QWERTY. So pseudo Pacman, the A here and the A there. And I got sick of typing all that. So I said, let's do SPS, SPR, remove RS dependencies or overwrite everything and just remove DD. So all of this, if it's unclear, Arch Linux Wiki Pacman. That's super important that you read that because that's our package manager. Okay, and here a little bit. I so the W simple screen recorder. All my videos on YouTube have been recorded with simple screen recorder. Guess what? Doesn't work on Wayland. So I've made an alias W for Wayland, and this is the one we're using there. So simple to keep track of things, right? 
same here same there done so that's your keep track of, of what happens on my machine and then there is of course the scale thing if that's working now yep it's working now so scale is actually an alias that points to a script and the script is going to say this it's going to point also to the website so go and have a look and, and read if it's still uh, skip this step can I can I hear allow there it is so this is all about scale it can be a blessing but it can be also a curse when is it a blessing if you start messing with code in i3 bsp wm mix monad you name it tiling window managers and it's is there's an error and it can be a space it can be a comma a semicolon it can, it can be anything and either you end in a black screen or you you're thrown back to sdm and then if you do scale then from tty for example then boom everything is again okay and yes there is a backup always so scale is what we do now yes we say to the system and then you see that here we have a scale backup sorry I here a backup that's the backup scale this is the backup so whatever I do now um, I always can go back I always can compare and say okay where is my code it over it has overwritten my polybar for example if on tiling window manager the only thing you need to do is go set it back copy to the left and so on but for first maybe have a look what's different right so scale is done that means I do the sudo reboot huh? Now, I don't know about you, but often I don't have the patience. So a right control R reboots immediately any virtual machine. Right control and then R. You might see some messages for about the hard disk, but huh? Okay, well, on. when new wallpaper, nothing that important. Up all update. And we're good to go all right and all the rest is up to you to choose all the themes and the icons and the wallpapers and put the bar at the top and whatever you want it's all up to you that's called rising and maybe i can go out with that little bit of advice that guys learn how to write your scripts we have get nemesis on arc linux and if you install the arch linux tweet tool it's also on there so Anywhere I go, I have this with me. So make a copy from this, change it any way you see fit, put it on your own GitHub, download it, run it, run number zero, boop, 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 and off it goes, running all of the other things. All right, enjoy your clicks. So the only thing, uh, summary, was the Arch Linux key ring. All the rest seems to be just fine. Cheers.